So cool. Day, good day it's kind of like a midday right now just at 1 30 in the afternoon i checked in last night at uh, Vendelhof. good thing because i got a chance to dry out my tent and everything else and this morning i left like around six o'clock and right now we are like about 55 kilometers outside of stewart bc also outside of uh, Vendelhof, i think maybe 15 or so kilometers maybe more I, I might be mistaken it's the, the Fort St. James which is like a historic attraction there but it opens up at 9 so obviously I missed that I couldn't go see it I didn't want to wait till 9 o'clock but it's a nice historic site it goes back to 1896 or the 19th century with a fur trade from uh, Hanson Bay and it's nice because they have uh, many restored uh, buildings from wood buildings from back in the day and also there's people there dress and do things as they used to do back in the day in the 19th century you can see the furs different animals they used to trade back then the Native Americans and the Europeans and it's nice to learn a little bit of history also they have the world-class chicken race so you pick a chicken and if it wins the race which is kind of funny to I believe to watch I only see it on videos but it wouldn't be nice to be able to go and uh, chill for the day decision is made and finally all day today I have a nice clear sky nice weather which is I'm stoked and happy about it and this is called the Windy Hill. I don't know if you can hear the wind or you can see the trees. But it's like nasty. No wonder why they call it the Windy Hill. Well, even though right now it's straight. <laughs> well, well, well. Guess what we got here. Come on, look at this thing. Look at this glacier. God damn. Jesus Christ <laughs> Oh Jesus That's spectacular And I guess on this trip You're probably gonna hear this word a lot Gotta find a rock Press 2 It's laying Man it's so windy 
the windy hill wow that is spectacular and that's like a fraction of what is out here wow towards uh, Hyder, Alaska. There's a boardwalk. Yeah, before when I was going through town I thought I hit uh, record but it didn't. But this is so amazing and obviously from the GoPro I don't think you will be able to tell but in the mountains there's all along this little waterfalls which is spectacular. Salmon Glacier, it's 28 kilometers out from uh, Hyder. But there's no way we're gonna miss it out. We came all the way here. This is, I don't know what this is. Obviously, this is closed. I think that's where the, in the salmon comes, and then the birds come out. And if you like it, you'll see them. But I think it's too early for the salmon. So it's called the Fish Creek. The water is so clear too. That's where the bears hang out. This is where the pavement ends, my friends. Now we are going deep into the back country. This deserves every penny. Wow. There's still some snow on the road and there's two skittles just left there. <laughs> but we're getting closer. We're getting closer, baby. That is spectacular. God damn. something else my friends that is something else
so unreal. I got nothing more to say, just enjoy the view. For something like this, I don't know, maybe we go through the elements, rain, cold, thousands of kilometers to come across something like this. Does it worth it in the end? I think so. Don't you think? That's what I was saying before, like, yeah, you have the cons riding, driving in the car, but even with a motorcycle though, actually knowing that you went through all that where you're gonna sleep where you're gonna camp when it rains all your camp gear gets wet and everything but then this is the reward you know nothing else matters spectacular and i'm uh yeah i'm super happy Unbelievable. I don't know what else to say. That's it. I'm out. There's a road down there too, but I don't know how far back it goes, but this is, I feel it fulfilled one of my dreams. It's amazing too because when I was young, I used to watch these documentaries with my grandpa in a little square box TV, you know, and who would have thought one day I will be here, I will make it here, and with my horse, <laughs> I can't describe the feeling, I can't describe it. <laughs> One last view of this amazing Thermal Glacier. Spectacular. <laughs> hey, and it's official, I gotta put my sticker. It's official. Spirit Traveler has been to the Salmon Glacier. It's official, y'all. Yeah. 
It's official. Yep, looks good. <laughs>